Oh, Reggie, he's bad axolotl. You know, if we took him out of the water, he would hunt on land. What would he hunt? Anything that moves. <laughs> Ben's mother passed away a few months ago. There was an old deed for coastal property. Legally, it's yours to do with as you wish. My mother never once mentioned this. Some families have secrets. It's the end of the summer. I Ben, look at this. It's incredible. I have a buyer who's interested. They've made a strong offer. Is that serious? I love you. The badger drew himself up, took a firm grip with his stick, and flung the trap door wide open. What is it? It's a water tank. All these old types of places would have run off rainwater. Something kind of tank. What do you think it is? I don't know. Oh, sweetie, something's trying to get in. Oh no, there's nothing we can do. No, can you feel it, honey? The tank was open. My mother wasn't crazy like they thought. Our time is coming. <gasps> oh. I got You got a friend. Some families have secrets. It's okay, it was just a bad dream. I heard it again. No more nightmares tonight. Okay, champ? <gasps> Daddy! This is getting ridiculous. This is an old house. There's bound to be bumps in the night. Peter drew this? Yes. Is he all right? Peter has an overactive imagination. No more nightmares. No more. That's right. You know, I wish I had someone I could talk to about the things that were happening in my house. decisions to protect your family. What is that? The banging. Enough! Enough! You don't hear anything, Peter. You have a beautiful imagination. It's going to get you into trouble one day. You busy tonight? You want to turn, eh? My mum leaves at nine. So you're at ten. <laughs> yes! So where'd you get it from anyway? Apparently it was the hand of someone who could connect with the dead. I heard it was the hand of a Satanist. Yeah. And the other hand's just out there. White people shit, man, I tell you. <laughs> All right, let's do this! You know the drill. Say, talk to me. Talk to me. Hey, 
really fucking stop and he's choking. Oh, 83 seconds, get it off him. <laughs> What if we open the door, but we didn't shut it? Ah! Delete it. Ah! Delete it, come on! The spirits, ah! they followed us. Oh, we have to do something. You want to do it again? Run. They're not going to stop. What was it? Run. What? I don't know! I let you in. Run. I let you in. <laughs> oh my god. Three. Two. One. Nothing. Oh, oh, dude, it's Pete. Oh, my gosh. My brother thought it was pretty funny. <laughs> Here in Salem, they didn't teach us all our history. Some stories got lost along the way. Maybe if they had taught us everything that happened, my brother would have left that knife where he found it. I will play. I won't quit. You know what I think we should do right now? Go to the party. Come on, let's go. Don't let me. If you play with me, then I'll let you go to your party, and I won't call mom. Okay, Joe. What game do you want to play? I'm not playing Duck Duck Goose. Just humor him. You'll all say, I will play. I won't quit. Tell me, demon. Am I it? Morgus? What did you do? Let's play. Marcus. Are you ready to play hide and seek? Marcus, why do you have that knife? Five. Why are you doing this? Four. Nine. Three. Two. Go. What is going on? It's not him. It's the knife. Found you. Uh -huh. Hey, buddy, you're just messing with us, right? How about some ah! hangman? It only ends when it wins. <gasps> what if we win? Only one way to find out. I will play. I won't quit. What's happening? I will play. Morgan! I won't quit. I will play. <laughs> I will quit. Now! Let's play a new game. Then the cheat. You picked John Kramer. John! The cancer is still spreading. I'm afraid there's nothing else we can do. There is one person who might be able to help. Our program is a two-pronged treatment. Outside Mexico City, the results have been stunning. She saved my life. You're in very good hands with us. After that, what happens then? Your whole life happens then. John Kramer. According to these scans, the tumor was never removed. How much time do I have? Months, at best. I still have a lot of work that needs to be done. Intended to cure me, but what I have planned for each of you is very real. Peace came upon me. No light, no sound. The only thing I have not provided 
is your anesthetic. But trust me, you will want to remain alert. Out of all the men to cheat, you pick John Kramer? Please, don't hesitate. Place a big enough piece of your cerebral tissue into the glass enzyme tank. This will save your life. So sleep, silent this is not retribution. It's a reawakening. Live or die, the choice is yours. I'm here from the Vatican because of your brother's death. I've come to bring the transparency to this tragedy. Before he fell into darkness, he was much loved by everyone. Fell into darkness. You saw my brother kill himself. The eyes of God are on us all. This was the ultimate confessional. The nuns, they stand here and for every sin committed. They take a step back. The more steps they took, they fell to their death. God caught them. We live a disciplined life here. Contained, cleansed, purified. Peekaboo, where are my clothes? Mother says we must first remove the filth from them. You're a woman of science. What is it you seek? My brother was badly hurt before he fell. I think he discovered something that he was afraid of. here when I have dark thoughts. I think I might be a really bad person. They are all lying. What is it that you think you know? One God. It's for you. <laughs> Strange that you and I have never spoken on the phone. This is long overdue. What is this place? A shrine. <laughs> Did you miss me? He's gonna keep coming after us. Maybe he gets to win this time. We've got to lure him in. And we execute him. Here you're a horror fan. It's been said. The RMS Queen Mary is a frightened ship. And she carries with her a premonition. Life. Of death. Imagine taking a tour of the Queen Mary. Not as it is now, but as it was in 1938. 
and the stranger stories. Ghost stories? You want to call him the haunted tour? leave my son alone here. Stay with me. Forever. David Ratch, traveling third class with his family. Piers, Mr. Ratch, lost his senses sometime after dinner. Captain, <gasps> there's been a murder. What did you do to my husband? He's with the ship. No. Happy Halloween! Famous for our fiction, sometimes facts can be much stranger. Well, when there are scary things we don't understand, our minds try to fill in the blanks. Sometimes the best thing to do is to face it. So this light is going to be completely silent like it is right now. Then gradually, it's going to start flashing until it's totally dark. So you can see that there's nothing to be afraid of. Okay? See? That's not so scary, is it? Just you, your sister, and me. You're doing okay. It's not real. It's all just in your head. You need to grow up! I'm serious, Sawyer! I need to be alone! You're both having these manifestations. What is this supposed to be? It's the thing that comes for your kids when you're not paying attention. Listen to me. Okay. I'm listening. <laughs> Sweetheart, let me handle it.
Welcome to Freddy's. Have you met them yet? Met who? Foxy, Bonnie, Chica, and Freddy. Back in the 80s. Some kids went missing. What is this? That's why the place shut down. The police searched Freddy's. Hey! They never found the kids. <laughs> Ghost children possessing giant robots. Tell me how to stop them. He don't. It's too late. He's coming. <laughs> I try. Wait, wait, please. I have hated this man my entire life. I know you know what you did to cover up for something inside your gut. It is festering, gnawing at you. I know you can feel it and try to bury it. But that rot is spreading, a decaying hole swallowing your heart. Ma'am, there's blood on you. Is it yours? I never really believed in ghosts.
En el pueblo. Estás asustando a mi familia. ¡Lo vi con mis propios ojos! ¡Estuve con él! Esto va a ser un infierno. ¡No! Tenemos que encontrar a la bestia. Antes de que nazca más. Los tiempos de la fe se terminan rápido. What if I told you that we live in hell already? Do you think that we see the entirety of everything that's around us in the world? We rely on our senses to experience the world. But can we say with certainty that there isn't more to the world than what we perceive with our senses? Still won't tell me what you're working on. No. If I tell you, you two will think I'm crazy. You know the pond is artificial. It was made by people so they could go fishing. And there's some theory about a crazy fish. There are symbols everywhere. In the woods, in the ponds, even in my home. Feed, your art got super lame. And you die in a fire. Don't judge me. Sometimes you gotta troll the trolls. I just roll up in my chest. Wow. find out who this handle belongs to. You really think a weird account is haunting your apartment? <gasps> Dear David, he was only 10 when his mother went insane. Linda, it's Dr. Landers. This is not my son! He is your son, and you put him in a coma? <laughs> oh my god. Dr. Landers?
Hercule Poirot. I've found something. I've looked at it from every which way. I am the smartest person I ever met, and I can't figure it out, so I came to the second. You are up to something, my friend. I've seen a million of these so-called psychics, each one a fake. I do not believe in psychics. Come with me to a seance. Spot the con I can't. Detective, you are here to discredit me, but I can talk to the dead. I'd give all I have to hear my daughter's voice. If someone wants to be heard, we are here. Listening. until I know who did it. A ghost killed her. There must be a rational answer for all of this. Just admit that you are up against something bigger than you. No! You were saying... Something in this house tried to kill me. Don't look at me like I'm a suspect. We're old friends. Every murderer is somebody's old friend. No one shall leave until I find if the living have been killed by the dead. You have been hiding here all this time. Who are you talking to? Prepare to witness the horrific rise of the next generation of evil. Based on the short story. By Stephen King. Comes the nightmare. Like you've never seen it before. sucks. So hard sometimes you can hardly breathe. But I can help with your pain. Brace yourself. He who walks, he talked to me. He took care of me. So now I'm going to take care of him. Like killing all the adults. For starters. Execution scheduled for 11 p.m. But he's trying to convince us he's gone insane. And therefore incapable of being executed. I need you to prove he's faking it. Edward? I'm gonna ask you some questions. I'm not Edward. I'm a demon. Demons aren't really a thing. What happened to Edward? We own him. We? He's a master manipulator. 
You have your head so twisted around you think you're the killer, not him. And give me something to make me believe you. Prove to me you're a demon. Probably just a coincidence. I want to talk to the real Edward. Edward. Makes me do bad. <laughs> I can't stop him. I need you to see something. You got a fan. Did the same thing with all his victims. Help me! I'm trying to, Edward, but you have to answer my questions. You have to tell me the truth. It won't let me! It can go away. It can go away. Yes? No. It's starting to happen. Can you feel it, James? Can you feel it? Okay. I think it's time we tell you exactly what it is that we'd like you to do. Time she like appears out of thin air like that. There's something in here. You can't see it. But it, it lives inside. first person I ever shown this place to. And why am I so special? Because soon we'll be Christopher and Mary Robin. We should be close now. We're not going to find them. We will. Pooh, Piglet, Eeyore. We were friends for many years and they're out there. Christopher, we need to leave. Now. I really need to find out what's happened here, okay? Did you see how to pull? We need to go! There's... Oh. Laura's dead. There's someone else outside. What was that? Please 
used to be friends. Why are you doing this, please? I would have never left, I swear, I swear. Getting the heck out of Ludlow! The hell is that? First place I learned about death was the pet cemetery. The secret place. Generation to generation, dead things buried in that land would come back for something else. Can you hear them? Voices. I think something's wrong with Timmy. He needs time to adjust. The people built the pet cemetery to protect them from evil. It's not Timmy. Something's talking through him. Mel, what have you done? We have to find Timmy. Now stop this. I held him the day he came into this world. And I'm gonna hold him the day he goes out. Chittler back in no time. My daughter went missing. Your lord does not have your child. Then who has taken my daughter? Every year we drive him out. But he stands in the fields and waits. Who stands in the fields and waits? Grace. A demon didn't take Grace. These people are sick. Are you afraid, Wicket? He's here. He will give us great miracles. Time to revel in chaos. You're gonna get our little girl back. This is how we love. The midnight sun will rise. And you will see his glory. I'd like to report a crime that hasn't happened yet. Have you seen the movie Back to the Future? Basically, I'm living that movie right now, which is how I know there's going to be a murder tonight. <laughs> Hate time travel movies. They never make any sense. Happy Halloween. How about we all stay in and hand out Halloween candy? No, Mom. You know how hard this time of year is for us. Your friends were murdered 35 years ago. It's not 1987 anymore. Stay safe, honey. I love you. Is it? 1987. Oh my god. 
I know. The 80s are almost over and I haven't even tried Coke yet. <laughs> I don't know. Oh my God. Mom. Fuck off and die. Jesus, Mom. Masita. Ay. Ay, ay, ay. Mamacita. Time for my birthday, bitch. <laughs> creepy ass cabin in the middle of fucking nowhere. What's the big deal? There is a murderer on the loose and you drove us into the woods. <gasps> oh my god! What? I forgot to bring vodka. Go, 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 yeah. You have seven and a half hours until you're stuck here forever. I need to stop all this horror before it happens. Do the machines kill us all? No. They more just rip apart the fabric of our society via dance videos on TikTok. They use dance against us? Come on out. The water's warm. Just so you know, I don't do blowjobs. You pee out of that thing. Just think, maybe if she did do blowjobs, she'd still be alive. Yeah, let's not make that the lesson. 80s weed sucks. This is just dirt. Look at all these twigs. You know, I could give you a gummy this big that has 100 times more weed than this. It's been a year. The dog just given up on him. It only takes one memory, one memory to get him started. You be okay? Just you and him. Okay, just you and Alex. 1937. Kelvin DeVoe. What the? The self-portrait, you found it. What can you tell me about Calvin? Why do you ask? I mean, they're exactly the same. He was a genius in this world and beyond. My mind's playing tricks on me. But you're out there all by yourself. I'm not here by myself. You've seen him, haven't you? Seen who? Calvin. He liked to hurt women. Hey. He loves his wounded birds. Loves. Alex! He'll be back. That's the thing about our family. We always come back. She has the perfect life, the perfect husband, Eat me. <laughs> the perfect career. I want to help you. I'm not so sure you can. The perfect flesh. <gasps> what, what just happened? From the uh, twisted psyche of Joe Lynch. It felt so real. I was in his body. And the universe of H.P. Lovecraft. Lovecraft. Who are you? Really? Italian, come on. Yeah, come on. Sorry. Wrong number. This is a magnificent body. It suits me. What's going on with you? Me? I'm just dandy. Brandy? You're that patient. What happened to Elizabeth Derby? You have to believe me, Danny. It's a fantasy to spice up your sex life. I think I'm losing my mind. That was the third time. It's 
forever. Tim. Hi, boys. I'll suck your cocks if you let me out. เพื่อความปลอดภัยและการคงไว้ใช้มาตรการของรัฐที่ถูกต้องนะครับผมขอต้อนรับทุกท่านในรูปแบบของ social distancing พอพวกท่านได้เข้าห้องพักแล้วห้ามไม่ให้ใครออกจากห้องพักโดยเด็ดขาดเมย์ไอคำนี้เขาไม่ได้ห้ามไม่ออกจากห้องเหรอหนูกล้าพูดเนาะใครเป็นอะไรตายเหรอเราไม่รู้ว่าใครครับน่าจะเป็นฆาตกรรมครับนี่ผมอะไรต้องกังวลเป็นพิเศษเลยป่ะมีคนตายขนาดนี้ยังจะคิดปิดบังความจริงเหรอส่วนฆาตกรเนี่ยมึงยังไม่รู้เลยว่าเป็นใครมีใครจะอธิบายอะไรกับผมไหมผมไม่ต้องการให้อะไรแบบนี้มันเกิดขึ้นอีกฉันว่าพวกเราได้ไปก่อนเถอะแล้วพวกเราจะเชื่อได้ยังไงว่าคุณไม่ใช่ตัวบ้านแล้วน่ะตัวอะไรที่พวกคุณพูดถึงเรื่องอะไรกันตัวบ้านอะไรก็ไม่รู้ที่มันสามารถแต่งอยู่ในใครก็ได้อ่ะแล้วพวกเราจะรู้ได้ไงว่าคุณไม่ได้เป็นคนทำมาแล้วรู้ได้ไงไม่ใช่พ่อหรือลีน่าแล้วจะรู้ได้ไงว่าไม่ใช่คุณอ่ะหนูได้ยินเสียงมันไอเหมือนที่พี่เฟรมไออ่ะเรื่องแรงกูกูจะจัดการยังไงกับเรื่องของกูนี่พวกคุณกำลังสร้างสถานการณ์ถ่ายอะไรกันอยู่หรือเปล่าใช่มีคนจ่ายเงินให้คุณมาดิสเครดิตโรงแรมผมหรือเปล่าคุณคือไม่ต้องสงสัยนะครับไปก่อนไปก่อนWhoa, a lot has changed since the last time we were here. My name is Paul Sturgis. I work for Nixon Oil. Supposed to ferry out to the rig from here. Dad, I think I see it. Is that it? Yep, that's her. I'm here to do the inspection. What is it? Protection. Protection from what? Mom. Hello. Anybody? Where the hell is everyone? What's going on here? Is that look? The black beamer. There must be some way off this rig. Nothing works. I don't think it can take much more punishment. This is not just any shark. It's a curse, brought on not by nature but by wrath. Wrath. He's gonna keep getting his revenge until the sacrifice has been made. Stop it. It's the killing. I have a plan. You will not take my family away from me. Kill the monster. Open your eyes, cabron. I know a big ass shark when I see one. Competitive field. 
I don't want to just have some nothing job. But it's hard enough being a woman in the workplace. There's a glass ceiling, and you can come to me if you need help. Come on, just invite me inside. Do you want me to turn the handle for you? You are crazy. We're all carnivores here. Margaret, an invisible man plagues the town of Iping. What rot? Clearly the folk of Iping have lost the ability to hear the words coming out of their own mouths. It ain't your ears that be deceiving you. Marvel. This is a manhunt. Have you experienced any suspicious occurrences? Strange noises? I don't know. Broken window. No. No. Nothing like that. I can do many things while invisible out of Things that ordinary men cannot. She's in league with him. Ask her. He's written all over her lying face. What part did you play in this? He's crazy and he's dangerous. It's time you chose a side. So why'd you call me out here? A couple of days ago, I get a letter from Grandad. It's marked about a month before he died. I made sure you get this letter to know my dying wish, that my acres of land are given to the local Aboriginal tribe. They've been a great help with my research. There's this local developer. He wants to buy the land off me. Tristan, you understand that Grandad's property has been in the family for generations. In Grandad's letter, he said the local Aboriginal tribe helped him with his research. What do you mean by research? What was that? We better go inside. It turns out my grandfather was a cryptozoologist. Someone who researches mythical creatures. He studied bunyips. This developer, what's he uh, gonna be um, developing? You know what this is worth to the company? This creature was what killed your grandfather. Now, Mr. Richards wants nothing more than to stop this thing before it can kill again. So this thing, still out there? It always is and always will be. 